quick, right before the video begins, this channel is giving away 1 million Shiba Inu tokens every day. To enter, simply subscribe to the channel, watch the video, then leave a comment using the hashtag hashtag Shibainu. Good luck! After Warren Buffett dubbed Bitcoin Rat Poison Square, it was evident that the seasoned investor had no love lost for a token or cryptocurrencies in general. However, given recent reports regarding his involvement with them, there may be reason to think that he has changed his mind. You'll have to watch this video through to the end to find out. I've also got some other updates and information, especially for beginners, that you will find very helpful. Disclaimer, if you're interested in receiving price predictions and cryptocurrency news practically every hour, this prize winner from yesterday is also included. Next proceed to my Telegram channel. Hey, Cheap Army, how you doing? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time watching, please note that I post videos about Shiba Inus and the cryptocurrency market. If you would like to receive daily updates on the newest news and information about Shiba Inu, please subscribe to the channel and enable notifications. This will ensure that you are the first to know when I post a new video. Alright, let's get started with today's video, has Warren Buffett finally changed his mind about cryptocurrencies? Here's the question. I'm new to the Shiba army and I'm wondering how much I should start with. I see a lot of people posting about 1 billion coins. A trader asked this question on the Shiba Inu subreddit, and in this video, I'm going to help you see how much money you should begin with if this is your first time investing in Shiba Inus. Well, recent news suggests that this might just be the case, and we're going to find out about all of that in today's video. But before we get to that, I've got something for our first time investors. Thank you. Since everyone is aware of the guidelines, strive to diversify your sources as soon as possible. How much do you start with? What do you think is a good starting amount? Portfolio and only invest in what you know. However, not everyone truly understands how blockchain works. We've witnessed, with envy, how many people's lives have changed overnight thanks to the explosive price rise of many digital currencies over the past few years. It's so revolutionary that even big banks and traditional institutions have started to take notice. You're probably thinking that it would be great to get some exposure, but since this is your first time, how much should you start with? There are a number of things you need to keep in mind. First and foremost, remember that stocks are less speculative because they correspond with real-world companies' growth potential. However, aside from stable coins that are linked to the value of fiat money, cryptocurrencies do not track the value of natural resources. Another thing to keep in mind about cryptocurrencies is that they are not accepted as legal tender in many industries, so investing in a digital currency like Shiba Inu means you are depending on someone else paying you more for it down the road. Given the current state of the Shiba Inu and the cryptocurrency market, it is reasonable to assume that the aforementioned will happen. Second, you need to take volatility into account. The cryptocurrency market is extremely volatile, and prices can drop quickly due to rumors. For traders with experience and skill, this can present a great opportunity as they can execute trades quickly. For newer investors, on the other hand, volatility can be frightening, which makes sense because they can lose everything. Nevertheless, there are ways to manage your risk, which will obviously vary from person to person but generally speaking, especially if you are a long term. The point is that you can't trade without money, so try not to lose it all in one trade. For investors, one tip could be to never sell regardless of the price. Essentially, huddle 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 for new traders, a tip would be to set aside only a small amount of trading money at first and even at that try to use only a portion of that amount rather than using it all. This way, even if your move backfires, you'd still have some money left to trade with. Never invest in cryptocurrency more than you are willing to lose. Unless you are certain that you could afford to lose every last penny of the money you have set aside to invest in cryptocurrency, don't do it. The money you may need in a few years for a major purchase or as a down payment on a home should be saved in a safe account rather than invested in cryptocurrency. That way, even if you lose it all, you won't be devastated. A FOMO management buy as explained by Smith1101, is one full. 
starter position to me is 3 to 10% of my portfolio or 3 to 10 full paychecks that is the smallest position I can have to feel exposed to something I believe in while a whale intends to accumulate more if the price keeps dropping. There's no absolute size that would be a good starter position, it's relative to what you make all right now to Warren Buffett and his team. Paycheck from my job or 1-2-3% of my portfolio that's enough to stop me from feeling like I'm totally missing the bow when it takes off. Warren Buffett has expressed his skepticism towards cryptocurrencies, particularly Bitcoin, on several occasions. The investment veteran has been against them from the beginning. However, he appeared to change his mind when news of his granddaughter's preferred investments surfaced. According to you today, Nicole Buffett, the granddaughter of billionaire Warren Buffett, told institutional investors that her collection of non-fungible tokens had almost sold out in a matter of months. Claims that Heather is the NFT space's currency and that rivals like Cardano and Solana are trying to unseat Ethereum's hegemony in the market for her tangible artworks. Although Nicole Buffett says she will still accept fiat money, she is determined to assist people in setting up so they can easily purchase art on the blockchain. What's interesting about Nicole Buffett's interest in Ethereum and NFTs is that her grandfather is a well known cryptocurrency skeptic, he even called Bitcoin rat poison squared. However, what's even more intriguing is that Nicole Buffett's decision to enter the world of cryptocurrency is based on her grandfather's investment advice. According to Nicole Buffett, her grandfather will examine something and determine if it has integrity and long-term value what are the parts, and are they breakable. Personally, I think it's particularly interesting that Warren Buffett has remained silent regarding his granddaughter's cryptocurrency investment, given his distaste for the market. Could it be that he has changed his mind and chosen to support his granddaughter instead? If so, his silence would seem to suggest that, and to be honest, it would make perfect sense. Warren Buffett is an experienced investor who understands the value of portfolio diversification and fun hedging. He also knows that the best way to hedge traditional asset classes is to invest in alternative asset classes, such as gold and cryptocurrencies. Although Buffett may have had reservations at first, a lot has changed in the industry since then, so it's also possible that he has since changed his mind. Nevertheless, if it turns out that Buffett has had a hidden cryptocurrency stash the entire time, I wouldn't be surprised. I suppose he owned Bitcoin and Ethereum, and I'm willing to wager that he also owns some Dogecoin and Shiba Inu. Given how popular main currencies have become, it's hard to ignore them. Dogecoin may be the most well-known cryptocurrency in the class, but Shiba Inu is making a serious comeback these days. Not to mention that Shiba Inu is becoming increasingly popular on social media. For these reasons, I think Warren Buffett may have invested in cryptocurrencies, including Shiba Inu. I don't need to speculate as to the potential consequences of the Oracle of Omaha purchasing Shiba Inu in addition to his own investment. Warren Buffett's support would persuade thousands of people who remain dubious about investing in cryptocurrencies in general and Chiba Inus in particular to do so. However, this is all just conjecture, so please share your opinions in the comments section. If you liked the video, please hit the like button and leave a remark, this will really help me with the YouTube algorithm. If you truly adore Shiba Inus, you have to see this video.